I, I was so sad to not stream on Saturday. <laughs> I bought the so so it's like five five fifty seven and fifty nine seconds and I'm like oh let me go on Steam and buy that game, uh the Nancy Drew, uh, apparently when I went and looked it's one of the old ones right it was like the sixth one, so it's from like way back in two thousand eight or something, and I bought it and started it up, and it it did that thing, <laughs> where it like forcibly changed the resolution of of my main screen to 640 by 480 and rendered the game in full screen and i'm like i can't even i can't even like i had to do all this stuff to try and get the obs windows and stuff like the chat window it moved everything moved around when my desktop changed sizes so i'm like this is miserable and even doing that i couldn't get it to capture the game so I'm like, is there a way to run it windowed? And apparently there is, but I had to dig around to, to find out how. And then I did that, and it pops up in a like a weird window that you that was rendered incorrectly. Like there were the the game was showing twice in two different colors and everything was messed up. And I'm like, okay, that's that's not correct. Then I went and got a program called DX Wind that lets you run full screen stuff full screen programs in a window without telling them that they're in a window and even that didn't work it was buggy so i was like sadly i just had to refund it so instead we're playing soft vision reset which was on my wish list for a while um i was just reminded of it because i was just um uploading videos from a year ago and somebody i saw where someone had recommended it to me they're like Oh, something something time travel. I'm like, okay, I legally have to buy it then. Oh my god, that was a, a little louder than I thought it would be. A moment. Do do do. I turned down the music on the the main in the options. It still, it might still be a little loud. Doo -doo -doo. Okay, go. The skies look clear to me. Do you foresee any problems, Oracle, with your vision, with your reset vision, with your reset soft vision? Yes, a creature will attack us soon, but it won't be too much trouble. That's good. Head up to the top of the ship so we can be ready for it. Let's jump. Let's shoot. No diagonal. Okay. Wait a minute. If there's ice, how did I get here? How did I really get here? And I can't wall jump, I guess. Or wall cling. Started this, but got distracted after five hours of play. I will endeavor to not do so. Time tree? I like the sound of that. Um, will I? Yep. Oh, hey. Alright, so I foresaw... <laughs> I foresaw that I would win this fight easily, so... Let's not make a paradox. You will lose this fight, Sheriff Ice. Spare yourself the humiliation and leave now. But we know that he doesn't. Halt, I'm Sheriff Ice, and you're trespassing on Sierra Isle. Nobody gets through on my watch. But does anyone get through on your listen? Oracle can perceive visions of attacks before they happen, represented by gray silhouettes. kind of funny because I like I go to dodge the wrong ones phew J just let me hit you already how are you dodging all of my ice shards without exception 
I can see the future. You have little chance of hitting me, much less winning this fight. It's not fair at all. <laughs> but watch this. How can you see my moves when not even I can see them coming? Oh, in the world, did you even arrive at that conclusion? Clever, huh? Your tricks won't work now. My, my tricks will absolutely still work. How is the fight going? He hit himself in the face with one of his own projectiles and is now plummeting towards the ground. Oh, mission accomplished then. As if there was any doubt. Great, I was worried for nothing. We'll be landing at Isles shortly. Why don't they just call it... Ice Isle. There's clearly ice on it. They're bad at naming. Don't stay any longer than you have to, as you've seen... This is a dangerous and well-guarded island. Well-guarded? Descendants of the ancient Syrians protect this island from intruders like ourselves to ensure the safety of the endoplanetary shield. Why not exoplanetary? Oh, because it's the opposite. So be careful on your shiny rock hunt. I appreciate the concern, but I'll be fine. Do you have anything to say about the tremors, too? Tremors? that. How odd the planet's volatile core is stabilized by the shield, which prevents the ground from shaking. In that case, it seems the endoplanetary shield isn't doing its job. It's doing the opposite job instead, and protecting us from attacks from outside the planet. I'll let you know if I find it. Great. In the meantime, I'll just provide, provide support from inside the ship where it's safe and warm and a certain time. Contact me anytime you want to talk. Brown. I wanted to talk to you immediately, except not really. Oh god, I'm being timed. Grom. Chamber save. If only I had the ability to jump doubly, but I don't. I have a feeling I will, though. Haha, <laughs> look at that. Oh, can't take that. Oh, because I'm full health, I see. That guy meant me no harm at all. Oh, I have to re oh. I have to recharge my uh time rewind. It's not automatic. Also, can't shoot through there. Very well. Whoops. No. My valuable time juice. It keeps freezing like that. That's weird. Oh, the blue triangles are what recharges my time juice. Blah. Hostile creatures are hidden nearby, waiting to ambush me. Unfortunately for them, I do not get surprised easily. Yeah, your flashback ability should make these encounters a piece of cake. To make things more interesting, why not try clearing ambushes while at full health? Flawless clear. <laughs> Could be the time travel. Got there. Pointlessly got there.
nice of the bees to collect time for me. I agree. Alright, well, someday I'll be able to double jump to that, and someday I'll be able to pillar destroy to that. Do I have a map? Mop? Zero percent. I think I'm doing a little better than that. There's the mop. Can, can I zoom? It's awfully tiny. <laughs> Oh, is there also... Is that why there's a timer? Because there's, like, a time line? Time spiders. All right, we'll have to find a new game. Yeah, it definitely, like, freezes on me every... It seems to happen, like, once a screen or so. Ah, puzzle. Ah, uh, I need to make this tree grow. Into the future. Huh. New conversation added to talk menu. When I examined your suit back at the lab, I was struck by how oddly fragile it is. It's composed of delicate materials and is quite slender. It even looks like it could tip over easily. Then it's a good thing it has a capable pilot, huh? Also, health upgrades, I find, make the suit more durable. Are these upgrades another one of the hidden features of the suit that get unlocked? No, they're more like attachments. Which is to say, they're physical items. That means you'll lose a health grade if you revert back to a time before you obtained it, right? Yes, but I never get hit anyway, so it's not a big deal. <laughs> of course you don't. How could I forget? Because you don't have a time machine. You gotta have a time machine to remember things. Oh, is it every minute that it's happening? I wanna pay attention next time. I need to know. Okay, cannot stand on spider webs. Wait a minute, the future told me that he was going to throw an acorn, but then he didn't. So we're like 45, 46, 47. Is it about to happen? No. Alright, hypothesis incorrect. Whoops. It just happened right there. way to backtrack. Was there somewhere else I could have gone? It doesn't seem correct. do that just to see what happens okay so it's just go back in time maybe I missed something here and I can somehow continue on definitely don't have a wall cling 
I'm dumb. Can I make that jump? I guess not. Goodbye. Maybe if I were good at video games, I could. Enemies seem to not respawn, which is nice. I appreciate their laziness in continuing to not exist. Exactly. Back in my day, time flowed at one second per second, and we liked it. Beedle 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 boop. Charge shot. Hold down the shoot button to release and fire a powerful attack. Exactly that long. Oh, wrong one. Stop. Despite its appearance, your suit is absolutely the most incredible piece of technology I've ever seen. Beneath the surface, there are a plethora of powerful features waiting to be used, but sadly, we can't access them. How frustrating. Yes, there's some crazy advanced security system in place that I can't make sense of. The only thing that helps are decryptors, codes that unlock these abilities for use. Say, Oracle, aren't you really good at breaking this kind of software encryption? Yeah, I think that's how I'm managing to use the suit at all. But for these individual features, I don't know. Things just aren't coming together for some reason. At least decryptors are information, which means they'll always be known no matter when I find them. Yeah, right before you departed, you inputted all the decryptors you had visions of finding. That makes me wonder, though, why are we finding all these decryptors on survival anyway? Not sure, but I'm not complaining. It's a time travel game, Zadok. I can travel freely through time. Oh, I get it, and they have it down here so that it's like, hey, guess what? How do you get out of here? Oh, you rewind time. Oh, uh, probably. Hopefully? Oh, interesting. Um, hmm. Can I just rewind? I am out of phase. Oh, well, I guess. Does just the 25% build up freely? Okay. Then can I? And I still have the, I still have the charge shot. So that's what they were, <laughs> I got, that's kind of neat that they didn't, they didn't really explain it. They were just like, hey, you're going to fall down here and you're going to, <laughs> um, real quick. Oh, or, or you could be observant and notice that certain things in the environment can be destroyed. Also valid. Oh, my, don't do that to me. Yes. <laughs> the, use the item you just got. So you can see each each enemy. Oh man, that's really gonna get me killed a lot. The, well, that too. <laughs> I seem to be having some kind of um, performance issue where the game just decides to freeze every once in a while. Is that a yes? Um, hmm. let's go up. Hmm. 
Ugh. Priddle for the card game. <laughs> You found a soldier creature card. Now you have a nice souvenir of the island. A snapshot of something that tried to kill me. How amusing. There is a detailed description of the creature featured on the card as well. Scientists used to come to Sager Isle often to study its fauna. The cards are probably some research notes they left behind. I am thankful for the information on these cards. It gives me an advantage in combat. Basically, I can deal additional damage to... Oh, alright. To every creature whose card I find. Sounds useful. Try to catch them all. Pokemon. I don't even know what it is. No. Can I just run then? Like, there we go. So it looks like once you die, you have like a, a snake is snake is dead. <laughs> dun 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 dun. I also keep thinking that if, like, when the the gray thing disappears, that that's as far as the attack goes, but that's obviously not true. Uh, I can go... Oh, is this where I... Yep, it is. It's where I just was. So I correctly went the wrong way first. Good. And that refills my health. Nice. And my visions. Ah, this is the, uh... Man, it, it keeps freezing constantly. Let me jot this down real quick. Rah! Rah! Reach for the sky. No, smaller book. Smaller book, go with your smallness. Is it... What is this? What is this notebook, and where did it come from? What are these items written on here? Is this from when I played Ion online? I believe it is. I took notes on paper instead of... Oh, no, some of this is... What is this? I do not know what this is. This is Dwarf Fortress. Ha. Uh -huh. Food, whatever. Well, that was fun, discovering an old notebook. Ah, Garland Steel. Here's some Final Fantasy notes. All right, so we shall begin at the beginning of the new stuff. Right here. Never write your password down. Never carve it into a wall and nearby, <laughs> nearby wall in massive symbols. Do, do, do. Also, don't make it only three characters long. Trust me on this. Looks like there's no way out of there. Yes, it seems I took a wrong turn at some point. I'll be sure to pick a different path next time. Next time? Oh, you mean once you perform a chamber flashback? Precisely. 
a chamber flashback lets me revert back to any point in time when I performed a, cham a chamber save. By accessing the time tree in the pause menu, I can go back a few minutes and plan a different route. Well, do it so you can get out of there. Or can't I just do this? Oh no, we talked for too long. <laughs> what a jerk. If he hadn't said anything, I could have just normal rewinded. Okay, so I actually, I want to go, I want to get back, right? But I can't, I mean, unless, unless I rewind even more, right? Is that the deal? Like, I can never get out of here? But now do I still have my card? I do. Nice. You solved the puzzle. How did you know the combination? The combination was written on a wall in a, of a room I had visited in the future. In one future, anyway. You're saying you saw the solution in a vision? And then you softly reset the vision? Amazing! What else did you see? Uh, remember the route where I collected the health upgrade? Just a little farther is a decryptor which unlocks my suit's ability to shoot charged attacks. Oh yeah, decryptors are just codes. They're similar to the combination you saw on the wall. Right, while I can't bring back physical objects, I retain any information I learn. Fascinating. So it was them explaining that uh, the health power-up, if I rewind before I got the health power up, I will lose it. But, um, anything that you find... So I guess basically... Okay, so, the map does remain explored. Oh, and you can even see the little... Some, some little things on the map. I wish it were larger, but that's okay. All right, be that way. Um, oh! How do I make it turn off? Didn't it... Oh, whatever. Up or down? How about neither? a thing. Mm. Just checking right here. Yes, underneath there is safe. Okay. timing middle can I sh can I die try cannot do <laughs> that was a spider spiders cannot be Pikachu's it's in the rules
So presumably, I'm going to activate all of these things. Both the good ones and the bad ones. This looks like it is warning me of a boss room. I remember where I got to in the game now, and you'll be pleased to hear I didn't stop because I stopped liking it. Good. Suit is safe in water. Breathing also okay. Reasons? Uh? Unknown. I keep seeing statues lying around. Or lying around. What are they supposed to represent? They're most likely depicting the ancient Sedrins. A highly intelligent alien race. We did not know how to spell. From what we understand, they used to have a thriving culture on Sedrur Isle. But about 800 years ago, they left this planet. Nobody knows where they went, nor why. Nor when. Well, that's not completely true. A few descendants of the ancient Sedrins remain on the island as guardians. But apparently they lack the immense knowledge their ancestors had. They only know how to attack you in repeatable, predictable patterns. And they're quite hostile. It's a shame these guardians aren't interested in sharing their culture. It is unfortunate. Scientists have tried coming to Sedrur Isle for procurement, but not many succeed. The ancient Sedrurians during their time here have created technological marvels. We have learned so much from what little of their scraps we managed to salvage. What did they make? We've procured energy generators, weapons, and more. But their most important invention rests underground, and it known, typo, as the endoplanetary shield. This massive shield wraps around the planet's explosive core, preventing it from damaging the surface. Generations of species likely owe their lives to the ancient Sedrurians for this reason alone. That's amazing! Do you think I'm an ancient Sedrurian? Doubt it. Your larva form. I have a larva form? Huh. Your larva form beneath the suit is much too cute to resemble these statues, but I'd say it's plausible that the suit itself is ancient Sidurian technology. Yeah, I suppose so. What what do you mean I'm cute? Babaka. Destroyed. But which one is the real one? I'll have to use my time uh eyes my time vision <gasps> my soft time vision reset oh they were all real I see now <laughs> oh we're in Brinstar or something whatever it was called whatever it was called that's what it is oh acceptable Hmm, acceptable but difficult to jump. Oh, okay. I can do it like that. Rant. <laughs> I might want to Google real quick <laughs> to see if there's any anybody who also has experienced these micro freezes. Constant micro stuttering.
Oh, they don't mention the game. I guess that's the problem with calling your game <laughs> Vision Soft Reset, is that... <laughs> unless I put it in quotes, it's going to come up with a lot of things that have nothing to do with that. Do, do, do. I don't immediately see anything. <laughs> Is there a game called Difficult Play Game? <laughs> or are you having a goof? Left. Left is the correct way to go. Just look. <laughs> Pew. This must be the endoplanetary shield. Oh, I landed on it? The shell that contains the planet's violent core, and it's on the verge of shattering. What does the future hold? What will happen when the shield finally breaks? I must concentrate. I was gonna say, yeah, can't, can't I just... I see. Do, 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 do. Get out. So this is what happens. The meltdown. How can I stop this terrible future from happening? With a time machine. The skies look clear to me. Do you foresee any problems? Wally, I've just had a terrible vision. The world will be destroyed and we don't have much time left. What? How? Why? The endoplanetary shield is severely damaged. Soon it will break completely, leading to the geolog geological catastrophe it was designed to prevent. Wait, I'm having a hard time processing what you're saying. The end of the world? That's unbelievable. You've never been wrong before, but are you absolutely sure your vision is soft reset? Yes. Unless we do something different, the future will pan out exactly as I have perceived. <laughs> I perceived it by, by kneeling for six minutes and just waiting. <laughs> and then I rewound time. What can we do, though? We haven't even landed on the halt. I'm Sheriff Ice, and you're trespassing on said Ryle. Leave immediately. All right, I need to deal with you. Hold on a minute, Wally. Don't fast forward through the fight. Everybody will miss how good I was at it. Should we tell the inhabitants of Sedril about this dire situation? Oh, were there inhabitants? I just assumed that literally every living thing I was allowed to shoot and kill. When I do, nobody believes me, and we can't waste time trying to convince them otherwise. It may be necessary to take hostiles like Sheriff Ice down by force. All that matters is stopping the meltdown. If an answer exists somewhere on this island, then I must find it. Do you know how much time we have? From when we landed on Sedua Isle, the end of the world will happen in precisely 20 minutes. <laughs> Before it was counting up, and now it's going to be counting down instead. Interesting. Yikes, there's no way you can explore the entire island in just 20 minutes. What are you, stupid? You never heard of speedrun.com? This freaking guy. This freaking guy and his idiocy. There are many pa different paths I can take. For example, my first few runs started with me heading right. But this time... <laughs> Perhaps I will begin by going left instead. You better hurry. Good luck, Oracle. Um, why would I need to hurry? I have a time machine. 
Stopping the meltdown. The endoplanetary shield is supposed to contain the planet's explosive core. Ah. And the planet's exo... Exoplanetary shield is supposed to protect the... Enploding... Imploding. The imploding non-core. But it's fractured and will break completely 20 minutes after we set foot on the island. Magma will leak onto the surface and every living creature will die. Oh, that's not that bad. I thought it would, like, explode and have consequences for me. Who cares about the environment? That's terrifying. What can we do? I'm going to search the island. The ancient Sergerines created the shield. Maybe they left behind instructions on how to fix it. Surely, such an advanced race would know how to implement some sort of failsafe. Yeah, that makes sense to me. Is there anything I can do to help Oracle? I don't know. Probably not much, to be honest. But I just can't sit here and do nothing. I can be useful. While we think about this rationally, you can't fight. And the only way you can defend yourself is by staying cooped up on the ship. I appreciate the remote assistance, though. Right, yeah. So I like this. I like this uh, this premise for a game. To go like, it's a, it's a Metroidvania... But you, it's not like you can't explore, but you need to be aware of the fact that you are always 20 minutes away from the game ending. <laughs> Oops. Well, just wasted 30 seconds. Yeah, there's, there's tons of design space in here. For, like, things that are gonna happen. Alright, so I need Super Zapper to get through any of the red. The red. Oh! Oh, and I don't have my... Of course I don't. Uh, should I go back? Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Oh, and I actually do... Ha I had two timelines there. Presu I guess presumably because... Okay, hold on. What's the fastest way to that upgrade? Oh! I'll have to do this ambush again. Way more flawless than last time. And that's also why it's fine that the enemies don't respawn. <laughs> Because I'll have to fight them again if I rewind. So I have grabbed that and will now run out to the ship. Save. And that'll give me a permanent save where I'm at the ship with that thing for any of the times that I want to go left. Uh, but I have to do this quickly. Uh, but also, I can't do it at all? Was I... I was... I... Hmm... There's no way back up without a wall, without, I don't know, rocket boots. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. So I guess I just, I have to do without. <laughs> Put a little post-it notes. Can I? I need a double. And, rah, I need a double jump.
Oh, we'll try going right. My visions told me which way to go. And then the bees gave me my time back. My honey time. <sighs> Don't stand there. Got it. is ending, dude. Come on. Damn it! Oh, and then I also died. Failed timeline. 